Hey, it's Kimmy B from the DJ Lads Morning Show on the new Hits 97.3 here at the FIU Coven Center for the fourth annual Senator Brainin Choice Challenge. And I've got to tell you, the day we have laid out for these kids, absolutely phenomenal from our breakout panel sessions where we're going to teach kids about making the right choice the first time. And of course, the behind the scenes panel where we kind of inform and educate and empower them to expand their horizons, look a little deeper. They can always be a part of the industries that they love, whether it's sports and entertainment, the arts, uh, maybe doing music production, whatever it is, there's a path for each and every kid that is coming through the doors here at the fourth annual Senator Brain and Choice Challenge. So it starts from today, decide what you want to do with your life. And that's what the Choice Challenge is all about. I'm Olivier Vernon here at the Kids' Choice Challenge, New York Giant, um, number 54 defensive end. And, uh, you know, I'm pretty much here to talk to these kids today and try to give them a little bit of words of wisdom. Craig Skilling, Skill Entertainment Group President, college professor, Johnson & Wales University Sports Entertainment Event Management Program. So the one thing that I think I would take away, besides the fact uh, all the panelists were phenomenal uh, in their own right, uh, but just the fact that that same urgency, the fact that right now is your time and that there's so many different opportunities. Uh, I think the theme for our particular panel was you don't have to just be a doctor, a lawyer, or an athlete, that there's endless careers and opportunities. So think outside that box that's right there and make it happen. My name is Dylan Christensen. I am a junior attending Miami Beach Senior High. I enjoyed coming and attending this year's Choice Challenge 2016. The speakers were very informative. They were, gave absolutely great advice that I could definitely apply to my life and help me achieve the goals that I've set for my future. Um, they stressed the importance of making good decisions, um, about the importance of education and making good friends and listening and gaining as much wisdom as I can from my superiors and from those that have gone through challenges before me. I decided to come to the Choice Times because I heard it was about um, um, choosing a choice for yourself and everything, so I wanted to see what it was about and everything. Thank you, Senator Brendan, Choice Challenge. Well, I was really excited about doing something for my community and doing something for what I thought were the people that I thought would most affect change in my community. And it's the middle school kids and it's the kids. The kids, I believe, are the future. I think that was said in a Coming to America song somewhere. I believe the children are the future. Teach them well and let them lead the way. And that's exactly what we're doing. And that's what the Choice Challenge does, is it gives them the ability and the, the tools to make the right choices. And that's why I started this. Yes. Because he first loved me. Yeah, that's it. Come on, let's groove. Come on. Oh, how I love you. How I love you. Somebody says, Oh, how I love you. Yeah, come on, y'all. Y'all can sing it. Oh, how I love you. Because he first loved me. I'm going to start making the right choices in everything I do. Choice Challenge was a great event. I loved it. It was very helpful and I can't wait to come back next year. 
Hi everybody, I'm Tiffany Miranda and I'm the founder of Girls Make Beats. We are a local nonprofit here in Miami that teaches young girls how to become DJs, music producers, and audio engineers. What I love about the Choice Challenge, I was able to sit with an awesome panel and they were so diverse, but they all had something amazing to bring to the table and speak to the children about. So I think it was really awesome to be a part of. So it is officially a wrap for the fourth annual Senator Brayden Choice Challenge here at the FIU Coven Center. And I got to tell you, today, another amazing day with all the outstanding young people that came through. Big shout out to all of the speakers who bless us with their knowledge and their experiences and, of course, their journey. Shout out to Olivier Vernon, now of the New York Giants, formerly of the Miami Dolphins, for coming and sharing his Saturday afternoon with these kids. And, of course, the entire event would not be possible without one superstar senator that goes by the name of Oscar Brayden. So, Senator Brayden, if you could please come join me. All right. Now, Senator Brandon, I got to ask you because your name is on the top of the event. How do you feel about the fourth annual Choice Challenge? I think it was awesome. I can't wait until we do the fifth one. And again, my name's on the top of it, but it would not have been possible if we did not have help from the Moss Foundation, Cox Media Group, Walmart, mm -hmm. Warren Henry. All of our sponsors have really stepped up and helped us bring this information to these kids. And I think they, they came away today with great information. So again, on behalf of Senator Brainin's office and the entire Cox Media Group family and all of our amazing sponsors, we thank you for helping us continue to help kids make the right choice the first time. We'll see you at the fifth annual Senator Brainin Choice Challenge next year. And for more information, you can check out choicechallenge.org.